What's going on everyone? A few months ago I made this flattening sled using linear rails. Now I listened to a lot of the comments uh, because at the time I didn't actually notice what was going on and because I was using this MDF sled for the router there was so much flex so I was ending up with almost like a bow to the woods that I was flattening. I've listened to what you guys said in the comments and I've gone out and bought some more linear rails. Let's get them attached. So I've actually gone for one meter lengths this time purely because eventually I want to make this sled a lot bigger. So a metre does give me a little bit more room to play with. Okay, so that's pretty much it. I've decided to make the base off camera because it is just a box, um, just using some of my other cuts. But as you can see, it's so much better, and I can put a lot of weight on that, and it's just not moving. There is still quite a lot of movement in it. I think maybe making something that can go both ends to make it perfectly parallel. But for the moment, that's all I'm gonna do. Someone did ask me what size screws this is and because this is a 12 mil bar, it, it uses five mil machine screws. So if that helps you, great. Now I'm just gonna throw on a piece of oak barrel that is uh, my next project so I just need to get it flattened so here we go Okay, so apart from what I've already said with the rails staying parallel, that is an issue. It does bind quite a lot, but oh God. if I didn't already say how much I love that bit that I got from AliExpress, I'll say it again. I absolutely love it. The finish on this piece of oak is absolutely incredible um, I can't say much else about it it is absolutely amazing if you haven't started using carbides already in your routers please do they are amazing again I'll leave all the links to the router bit that I've used plus the extension collet as well down in the description but the one main thing that I do like about this which I didn't originally do was I screwed the bloody router down to the sled. Simple thing I know, but I started using it and I could feel it rocking. So I put in a few screws and um, it's now rock solid. So good stuff. I'm gonna carry on and try and flatten this a little bit more because I need to actually see and see in something that I've designed. Thank you for joining me. Like, 
subscribe, share this video, do whatever. Until the next time, see you soon.